Good afternoon, everybody. It's me again. Actually, I tried to make a video the other day, and I didn't have the mic plugged in right, and uh, I had lots of video, no audio. That was really nice. Sometimes I wonder about myself. Anywho, uh, the weather today has turned into Pennsylvania winter. Um, so I went out, decided that uh, the Buell train show was going on at the Buell Club in Sharon, PA. Took a venture down there. When I left West Middlesex, Route 18, the main route up into Hermitage, was running wet. Every road I've been on since has been snow covered. Whether they've just been plowed recently or whether they are, they haven't been plowed in a while. Uh, some places there's been enough tra traffic actually to pack uh, like a layer of ice underneath. Um, so I put the truck in four-wheel drive. Um, not a good day to be out playing around. So what did this dumb dumb do? After the train show, I decided let's go out and see how much snow is out at the Beaver Dam. Uh, Beaver Dam is about 12 miles maybe from my house. Not even that. Um, but sometimes when you come out here, uh, it can be doing nothing at my house, and uh, you get out here and you know, it can be completely different weather. Welcome to Pennsylvania. So I get out here. There's about uh, well, maybe four inches of snow, um, and it's still coming down just as fast as you please. Uh, not going to stick the camera out in it. Uh, I, I kept the truck in four wheel drive. Uh, maybe I'll do this. I'll, I'll run the windshield wipers. Uh, and that's the road coming back into the beaver dam. So uh, three, three and a half, four inches of snow maybe. Uh, drove back in. If you look right here, uh, either the beaver has been uh, out on the pond or a muskrat has been out through there. It's a pretty good size. Um, might be a beaver. This yesterday was not skimmed over. Uh, today it has uh, the, the whole pond. All this gray slush yesterday was open water. The stuff that's white was already frozen. But uh, yeah, so I came out here. Uh, rifle season is now over in Pennsylvania. So I thought, well, maybe if it's snowing, maybe these uh, deer that I see out here, if there's any left, which I'm sure there are. Uh, maybe these guys will come see me. I'm not going to stay here real long. Because, uh, snow is still accumulating. And I really don't feel like... I uh, really don't feel like being out here in the middle of nowhere uh, at night in this kind of snow. Uh, not really concerned about getting stuck or anything but why take the chance right so I'm going to uh, shut the camera off here and uh, see what we can see uh, even the main lake now has, uh, has frozen over uh, has slush on it in most places so we'll see what we can see uh, I'll turn the camera back on if something comes up if you can see that guy right there or not one beaver is out on the beaver dam right there doing some work. The other one is just swimming back to the beaver hutch. Or out on the beaver hutch. He's not on the beaver. He's not on the dam. He's on the hutch. Uh, when I pulled in here and I had my window open, I could hear something. And it sounded there's the beaver just came up over right in here. I could hear something. I said that sounds like a beaver chewing on something. I quietly got out of the truck. I tried to take a picture, but he submerged before I could get it. But if you look, right here in the background, there's a tree. And when I first got the camera out, he was gnawing on the branch of that tree that was down in the water. So hopefully, uh, maybe they'll, they'll come around if I just sit and be quiet for a while. We'll see if we can get you something.
I don't think you'll be able to hear it, but there's a beaver gnawing over that. Right now there are four beavers out. I knew there were three here. I'd seen as many as three at one time. There's three over by the hutch and there's one swimming across back to the hutch right now. Just popped up beside me. That's what you're watching, that trail going across the slush. That's the beaver swimming back out to the hutch. So that makes five beavers that I've seen in the last 15 minutes around the hutch. The most I'd seen before that were three. snow plow if you will. So we'll see you in a little bit. I'll see if I can catch a couple deer on the way home maybe. 